to another episode of the Financial Conflict Coach Show. I'm Dave Hilton, the Financial Conflict Coach. I appreciate you watching today. Well, you know, over the last several weeks, I've received several emails from people wondering why it is that I give up a full 60 minutes of my time for free to people who are interested in financial conflict coaches. Well, there's a lot of reasons I do that. Okay, One of the main reasons is that I want to have plenty of time to sit down and talk with you. I want to talk to you about your situation. I want to talk to you what kind of conflict it is you're dealing with in your personal or professional life. Because there are some times, not a whole lot, but there are some times uh, that people who are interested in financial conflict coaching actually need the services of some other type of professional. Maybe a financial coach, maybe an attorney, maybe an accountant. It's not something that I actually uh, can help somebody with. Because I'm not going to waste your time. I don't want you to waste my time and I don't want to waste your time. So I want to spend a full hour at my cost, I mean, I'm, I'm the one paying for this because I can't uh, do anything else during that time. I'm willing to do that to make sure that what it is you're looking for, that you and I can work together and, and accomplish something uh, to help you in your life. The other reason I do that is because I want to make sure that we get along. I mean, that's a very important part of working with anyone is making sure that you have a rapport there, making sure uh, that you understand each other, that you communicate well. So that's another reason I do it. There's another reason I do it as well is because I want to have plenty of time to talk to you about the five-step process that I use in my financial conflict coaching. I want to make sure that before you and I agree to work together that we both completely understand what we're going to do during that process. So in this episode of the Financial Conflict Coach Show, I'm going to go over quickly this five-step coaching process that I use for my financial conflict coaching. Step one, as I mentioned before, is that initial consult. I do that for free. It is a full 60 minutes at no cost to you, just so you, can, you and I can sit down and talk either by phone or by Skype uh, to get a better idea of what it is you're looking for, what kind of problems you're facing in your professional and personal life. And I want to make sure that you and I get along, that we communicate well, that we can get along, and that my my uh, services can actually benefit you. So I do that in step one. That initial consultation is absolutely free, and it's a full 60 minutes. Step two in the coaching process, if you and I decide that it is going to be beneficial for you and I to work together, I do a conflict analysis and discovery. This is where you and I sit down uh, once or twice, uh, again, via Skype or over the phone, uh, to discuss your particular situation and get more details about what's going on. So I kind of analyze what's going on in your life, uh, get some more details, ask more questions, you ask me more questions, and then we'd move to step three, where we explore assumptions, we explore the goals that you have, and there are several exercises and different things that you and I will do together, as well as things that you'll do on your own during step three, as you explore the assumptions that you have about a particular situation, and also as you try to identify the goals that you have. Step four of the financial conflict coaching process is to identify potential options. One of the most important things about coaching is that coaches help you identify options that are available to you because you can get what I call those financial blinders on whenever you're stressed or in a stressful situation or in a disagreement. Uh, a lot of times what happens is, is you sort of get this, this tunnel vision. You put those blinders on because all you see is that person or that group in front of you who have made you mad or upset you in some way over for finances or money in some way. And so what we do in step four, after we've done all these exercises, after we've uh, analyzed the situation, discovered all the details and explored the assumptions and what it is you're wanting to do, your goals will identify potential options that you can take. Now, again, during this entire process, I never once tell you exactly what you should do. I don't give advice I provide options. That's what I do as a financial conflict coach. And then finally, step five is where you take action. That is after you've identified all the potential options uh, through all of our conflict coaching sessions, where you come up with what it is you want to do, you take action, and then technically there is a step six where we follow up a little bit after uh, you decide what it is you're going to do just to see how it actually came out and uh, to see if you need any additional help or perhaps a referral to some other professional at that point in time. Each and every one of these steps is extremely important during the coaching process to ensure that you get your value out of the coaching because every situation is different. Now, the great thing about this five-step coaching process that I use is the fact that it can be used for individuals, it can be used for couples, it can be used for groups, it can even be used for business purposes. So it's extremely versatile, and by using it, I help people just like you effectively manage, control, or resolve financial conflicts in their personal and professional lives.
Hopefully now you have a better understanding of the five-step process that I use in my financial conflict coaching. Of course, I'd spend more time with that if you were to sign up for one of my 60-minute free consultations. And you can do so on the website at financialconflictcoach.com. Dot com, and we can talk about your specific situation. You can also send me an email. Feel free to email me, coach at financialconflictcoach.com. You can also find me on Twitter and Facebook. On Twitter, I'm at Money Conflicts. Again, that's at Money Conflicts. So just find me on there. Email me your questions if you have any, or go ahead and sign up for your free session now. Again, do that at financialconflictcoach.com. Thanks for watching.